Hello and welcome back to my channel or if you are new here then hello, welcome. <laughs> by the title of this video. I am doing a what I got for Christmas 2020. Now I just want to put a disclaimer out there. I am not bragging. No way, ship or form am I bragging. I just love watching these videos every year because you know it's just nice to see what people get and at Christmas time I am all about giving them receiving but I just like watching these and I know that this is a really requested video every single year so I thought I would bring it to you this year. I'm so grateful for what I've got this year. It's been a really tough year for everybody and you know just bringing some Christmas cheer it does feel really Christmassy even though it is the what, Monday the 28th of December it's that in between week between Christmas and New Year that nobody knows what day it is nobody knows what's going on but it has snowed last night so I've woken up to snow outside so it does feel a bit more Christmassy today thought what perfect day to bring this video to you so if you do like this video please give it a huge thumbs up subscribe down below if you're not already and let's just get straight into the video if you've watched my previous videos you will know that I get a lot of chocolate and sweets every single year which me is just the best present ever I'm just gonna I'm not gonna go in any particular order I'm just gonna go and get what's like in front of me and stuff and then I've got a big present behind me which I will probably show you last I'll start with the box of chocolates so for my brother I got just a box of celebrations for me and Cameron my brother isn't really one for buying presents or the whole Christmas thing really so I was just happy that I at least got something from my brother which I like celebrations anyway so I also just want to say as well like everybody asked me what I wanted for Christmas this year and there was nothing that I really wanted this year because I pretty much got everything that I wanted just a happy family and everything like that so what people got me was I was expecting it I didn't ask for it nothing like that so that kind of made it a little bit more special as well so from Cameron's mum she got me and Cameron a she does this every year she gets us two boxes of chocolates for me and Cameron to share every year and then she also got me a cute little Avon which as you can see I've already opened it and it's honestly the cutest thing I've ever seen so it's a cute like little Prosecco like glass thingy and then inside the Prosecco glass is some really really beautiful earrings which I was not expecting at all and I love the fact it just comes in a Prosecco glass like Thing as well like how cute is that and then because I obviously said I didn't want anything for Christmas she then also gave me money to buy whatever I wanted to buy instead of just buying a present that I wouldn't really enjoy that much so I'm very grateful for that then sp sticking on the same theme with Cameron's family Cameron's brother also got me money because he didn't know what to get me and then his sister got me this cute little Ted Baker set which is so cute was not expecting this so it's in this like cute little um bag and then inside the bag there is some hand cream there is some body spray oh, a candle and a lip balm which is in this cute little tin as well which i just thought was really really cute thank you to cameron's family for getting me these i'm very grateful then i may as well go on to like what i got myself so like this year i decided i wanted to treat myself um it's been a really hard year and i've saved up because obviously you can't do anything you know i was supposed to go on holiday everything like that so i thought i'd save up and get myself a cute little gift so i actually got something from louis vuitton which i waited outside queuing in the rain for 40 minutes just for this and i just love the packaging like it like obviously comes in this so i have actually got it on so i actually purchased a louis vuitton ring so let me just bring it a bit closer so this is the ring that i purchased and yeah like i don't wear it all the time because it's actually quite weighty and heavy on your finger got the ring stuck on me finger and i was stuck in the shop like i can't get it off and i was shaking i was like oh my god i can't get it off what a mad story i will obviously like that because i had to try be a little bit more because i'm in an offensive shop i was like um can't get it off how do you get it off she was like just twist i was like okay then we'll move on to what my friends got me because they're obviously right in front of me so i actually opened my present from my best friend ellie probably about two weeks ago now yeah it was like a week and a half before christmas she wanted me to open it that's why i opened it so again she asked me what i wanted for christmas and i said i didn't want anything so she took her own initiative to get me a self-care box so she asked me what my favourite colour was and I said it was blue. So she's gone with the blue theme, obviously blue box, blue tissue paper. Then inside there's just like loads of stuff that's blue. So she got some face fax brightening sheets because obviously it has blue on it. She got me a blue body mist, blue Vaseline, 
a blue candle from Morrison's, which is, I don't have a scent, but that's the candle. Then she just got me loads of chocolates and stuff. She said she's done this for like majority of her friends and majority of her friends said their favorite colors were pink, which she said was a lot easier, but. Then she's got me a Terry's chocolate orange, my favorite. So then she also got me two Terry's chocolate orange bars. Then she's got me some Lindor salted caramel chocolate, which has already been opened because I've never actually tried them before, so I thought I'm gonna try them. Then she got me some Oreos and then a box of millions and then she also did get me a cute little note she'd also put a card in it but obviously taken a card so if you don't know i have a cat and like my cat is literally my baby like literally so she got me this little card and it has it ha did have this bracelet on it so it has this cute little bracelet on that has a cat on it of course it's blue but it's faded because i've had it on nearly two about two weeks now so this little message says the cat the cat shares a message of balance life is all about opposites work and play action and rest dependence and independence let this cat totem remind you that it's healthy to take a break sometimes and you can rely on other people without losing your independence and she said she got me this and this self-care box because she knows I've had a bit of a tough year so she wanted to like let me know that she's there for me which I thought was really cute such a vibe and from my other friend she got me gave me this cute bag so the main present in here was a photo and a photo frame so it says friends and then it's got our friendship group on there I am one of these people that's got like three different friendship groups or two friendship groups and then just separate individual friends so this is one of my friendship group which Natalie was the one that got me this one um I haven't seen the rest of the people in this photo because obviously covid and they don't live quite close to me so obviously they're in different tiers to me and we've arranged in the new year we're going to meet up and swap presents so i'm excited to see them but yeah i just how cute is this frame though i can't wait to put this up obviously cameron is in it and i said to cameron when i opened this up like we're all in black apart from cameron he's not he clearly didn't get the memo then she also got me this festive feast vanilla bubble bag and it looks like this which is so cute it's like a snow globe and you can sort of like see in it so i'm excited for that and then she also got me a cadbury's fudge right i think do cameron next because oh i haven't done my grandma i'll do my grandma next and then we'll do cameron but my grandma got me some this is for me and cameron so got me some quality street so yes i now have two boxes of quality streets two boxes of celebrations and then she also got us a box of biscuits which are victoria biscuits and these haven't been opened yet so i'm so excited to open obviously got some Maltese truffle next we'll go on to Cameron so I did actually give Cameron like I sent him loads of links to loads of stuff that I wanted they weren't on my Christmas list because obviously I didn't have anything on my Christmas list but I was just thinking of things that I thought about over the year that I thought oh I might buy myself this and like never actually did so normally we go out and we buy a big present for each other and just get one present because it's like a big present and on the list was this ring but then we agreed that and Cameron had obviously a big thing on his list but then we agreed because it's been a shit year we thought we'll buy each other loads of little gifts that add up to the same amount we would have spent and then we've got more to open on Christmas and it feels a little bit special so that is what we did this year one of the gifts he got was a new dressing gown from New Look so it's like this like nudie colour inside and then a whitey colour outside it's obviously got a hood and it's literally the closest thing since Christmas day this is what i've been seeing in on after once i finish filming this video this is what i will get back into because i just love a cozy dressing gown if you watched my video last year my brother did actually get me a dressing gown but it was like a hotel towel dressing gown so it's not as fluffy so it's not as warm so i am going to keep that other one that my brother got me because it's still in good condition but this is just so much better for when it's winter and it's just so cold then i actually most of the stuff that i asked for i actually got other people for christmas and really liked and wanted myself so i actually got my sister a instax mini and and I actually really wanted it myself. So I asked Cameron to get me one or me as well. So I got my sister the pink one and I've got the blue one. So this is Instax Minute 11 camera in blue. And then as a separate present, he also did buy me some Instax Minute films. This is 10 sheets times two packs. So there's 20 in there. So I'm going to get such good use out of it. I am thinking about doing a unboxing slash trying out the Instax Minute. Let me know if you want that video. Then he did, I did request some new underwear. 
also he did get me a lounge set from lounge which is the mesh set so it's like mesh underneath and then it's not mesh at the top so that's what it kind of looks like and then obviously the bottoms to go with it but i don't want to show you in too depth because yeah it's underwear then i did get my dad's girlfriend a bracelet from warren james and i saw it and fell in love with it i literally wanted to buy everyone one i wanted to buy my sister one i wanted to buy my mum one i wanted to buy me one everybody but i thought oh, i can't get everybody the same gift so i obviously did purchase it for my dad's girlfriend and then asked cameron for it myself so it's this really cute bracelet from warren james and this is what it looks like so it's like a um you can get a cartier version which is i think i had a look it's like six grand this is like the cheaper version of cartier and i'm so excited i did get it in silver because i wear i mix and match it up you shouldn't mix and match it up but i do so i can't wait to put that on and then we've got this big bag here so this is abba summer i can never pronounce it i will try and link this down below but i asked for a new handbag for christmas now this is like a really really expensive handbag normally i just get like cheap 10 20 pound handbags but i've noticed they don't really last me they like break but you can tell with this this is really good quality it's really thick it's not going to break anytime soon a little funny story is the reason why i actually wanted this because you could get it personalized with your initial on the front so i wanted an s on it cameron said he didn't he didn't know he had to do that but i don't know how the website would know which initial to put on the front without adding the personalization on but it's fine i have actually already got loads of stuff in here so <laughs> i've got tights and a headband in one section so this is what it looks like in the middle so you've got one section there one section at either side and then in the middle it's like a zipped thingy so i currently do have my purse in there and i just love it it's got the rose gold detailing because the silver and the gold was out of stock but it's fine a girl loves a bit of rose gold and i'm so excited it's like such a good bag i'm definitely going to get a lot of use out of it for sure and yeah i just love like the crocodile effect on it as well i don't know if you can see that love it it's so good and this is going to be like obviously used for work mainly and he did also get me another present but it hasn't turned up i don't have a picture of it or anything but i did one thing i did really want for christmas was a like um a clear plaque that has a song on it which is man and cameron's song um, i'm not really sure which song he's, i know he's picked well i'm not sure i'm not sure what the song he's picked i haven't seen it nothing like that will be coming so keep an eye out on my instagram if you want to see that when it eventually turns up then not we're just going to dive into this massive bag that i've got here which is from when i went to my dad's house i haven't taken everything out yet so it's mainly all from my dad and and my dad's girlfriend in here so one of the presents he got me which i didn't put in the bag was this if you didn't know i say that quite a lot i obviously am italian every time i go to italy i do like to try the aperol spritz so he actually brought this back from italy so he didn't buy this in the uk it actually came from italy which is why it is in italian so it's basically aperol spritz so i can't wait to try that out i need to put that with my alcohol section which has significantly grown this year so let's just bring this bag down here and let's just dive right in from my dad again my dad didn't ask what i wanted for christmas because i didn't want anything so he just got me loads of little bits that he just thought i'd enjoy so he actually got this white chocolate melting snowman which is so cute i did actually have the milk chocolate one but my sister didn't want the white chocolate one so we did a little swap got marshmallows inside and i'm so excited to try that out that might be a tonight thing actually then of course every parent has to get their child a one of these well i don't i'm not quite sure what they're called but it has a chomp in it a freddo buttons fudge curly whirly they'll be gone later as well he also got me some mns food chocolate chip cookies i'm going to keep this tin when i've done with it i have already opened it and had some out they are in individual bags how freaking cute is this little tin from mns it's the cutest thing ever so i will be keeping that I'm not sure what i'm going to do with it but i'm going to be keeping that then he also got me a anchor charger so you plug it in and it's a wireless charger so you literally just sit your phone on top of this circle thing and it charges which i think is pretty damn cute you yep he got me that i haven't tried it out yet so i'll be plugging this in tonight and trying it then i think this might be like one of my main presents i need to sort this out today actually so it's a three higher synth flower so you actually plant it yourself so you fill the pot with two thirds of the potting soil press the bulbs with the tip pointing upwards firmly into the soil cover the bulbs with the remaining potting soil but leave the tip of the bulbs free from soil place the pot in a cool five to ten degrees dark and ventilated spot when the buds are five centimeters after 10 to 12 weeks the pot can be placed in full daylight at normal room temperature keep the soil moist but do not overwater. turn the pot occasionally partly so yeah it's this like old flower that you have to grow yourself which 
I tend to kill flowers, so we'll see how it goes. Yeah, I'm excited to do that. So I'm, I'm actually do that after once I've filmed this video because it needs doing ASAP. I'm not sure how long it lasts or anything. I'm not actually sure like where he got it from or anything. Then he also got me some clear nail varnish, a nail polish remover pads, which I've never actually seen before. And then, then we're going to what his girlfriend got me because my camera is flashing now. So she got me this like coffee inside. It's a coffee cup, which you could, oh, you can't, yeah. I like a latte glass with marshmallows in. Um, it's got hot chocolate and then it's got something else in it. I'm not sure what that thing is at the back. So she got me that. Then she also got me this. So it's a massive tub. Like, look at it compared to... It's the size of my head. So she got me a massive tub of sweets the size of my head with some three candy canes there. And I just love the bell. So there's, like, fizzy sweets, jelly babies, marshmallows, like, loads of sweets in there. So I can't wait to try them out. Then she did get me some cute slippers from Primark. And I normally do buy these myself every single year. This year I haven't because I haven't really got myself off to Primark. So I'm so grateful for new slippers. Ooh, they're so comfy. The memory foam as well. Then, then she also got me this trinket dish, which is the cutest thing ever. So there's that which has an S on it, and then there's also that. Um, so I think that's the lid for it. And inside it says you are lovely. And how cute. Like that is the cutest thing ever. I just love it. Oh, and then my dad did get me and Cameron a panettone, which again is Italian. So it's an Italian sort of like Christmas cake, really, which is cute. I actually forgot about that, so Cameron will be excited to eat that pretty soon. Now that I've finally got it out of the packaging. So I'm really sorry, like, if the lighting's changed, the angle's changed, everything. So basically, my camera has just died on me, and I really need to get this filmed today. So, yes, I'm just importing this bit. So the next person is my sister mainly. Like, she was the one that actually picked this out and then asked my mum to go half with it. It is from my mum and my sister. But yeah, I thought I would show you a few little, like, little bits that she also got me as well on the side. But her favourite shot is scented creations which is i believe it's only really around our area where there's a shop i think basically it sells like loads of wax melts and stuff like that she has got me a scented creations snow fairy exfoliating soap sponge it's actually soap like in the shape of like a sponge so when you obviously you're in the shower or the bath you just scrub yourself and soap obviously comes out which i think is really really cool and it's in the scent snow fairy which is my favorite lush scent as well so then she also got me loads of wax Wax melts, so she got me Merry Morning, which is this white one. She also got me Rhubarb Rose, this pink one. Such a strong smell coming from this. Then she got Sweet Berries, which is this blue one. And then she also got me Frankincense and a Black Cherry, which is this big purple one. And then she also got me Marshmallow Fluff. I need to dig out my wax melt which i also got from scented creations um i need to dig that out and put it somewhere because i haven't finished like i've still got loads of like stuff that i've just shoved in cupboards where i'm not sure where to put them yet so yeah i'm gonna have to dig that out and use them then she also got me a little fluff ball which has dp on it because she got it from dorothy perkins because i did have one on my keyring but it got really dirty and disgusting so i did take it off so now i can put a new one on my set of keys then the next present she did actually get me my dad and herself the same present so again if you didn't know i am italian so she got us this mug which is from disney the disney store so it just says italia written all the way around it with mickey mouse there so yeah it's cute and then obviously it's red inside which is so so cute I'm sipping my tea in this mug then well, let me move to the side <laughs> not sure i can show you in one frame so she got me this big big buckle so i'm gonna have to be careful when getting it out i'm just gonna keep it back there and get it out so oh my god can i even show you in this frame oh my goodness oh i'll have to sit it up like that so she has got me this a uh, mirror which is a vanity mirror so it's got lights all the way around which you plug in and you can switch on then at the bottom it is touch screen so you can press on off on off it's super heavy so let's just lay that down <laughs> So yeah, that was my main present from my sister and my mum, which I love. I can't wait to plug it in, try it out. So that's everything that everybody got me. So yeah, I think that is everything. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. I've now got a lot of cleaning up to do. If you did, please smash a huge thumbs up button. Don't forget to subscribe down below if you're not already. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.